Well, now to our big story tonight. Milwaukee police investigating a possible abduction of a 10-year-old boy. This happened on Saturday. Christina Van Zels live outside MPD headquarters where we're hearing from police for the first time. Christina. Ben, police tell us they still don't know who the boy is or who the suspect is or if this was an actual abduction. We did talk with one neighbor who says she's noticed more U-Hauls in her neighborhood, but no one that's been moving in or out. She also talked with a woman who says she saw the entire thing. It's Memorial Day, a day off work, but for this woman, it's hard to relax. You don't know if who's around the corner. She lives near 39th in Meineke, the block where police are investigating a possible abduction. As someone who has kids and grandkids, she was afraid to be on camera, but she tells us what another woman said she saw. He was tussling, he was hitting the little boy. She said he hit him in the face, she, he choked him and, and put him in the back of the car. MPD says whatever it was, it happened Saturday morning. Investigators say a man driving a U-Haul was seen going up to a child, striking him and putting him in the U-Haul. The suspect then drove west. This can happen right up under your nose at 11 o'clock, broad daylight. Police say the suspect is a Hispanic male in his 30s, about five feet tall. He was wearing a beige baseball hat, beige shirt, and beige shorts. The boy is believed to be a 10-year-old African-American. That's scary for this woman, who says the area is full of kids. There's a lot of kids over here. they out in the summertime. they playing. The thing is, no one in the area knows who the boy might be. Police say that's why they aren't sure if the boy was abducted, because no one has reported a missing kid fitting the same description. But they are investigating it as an abduction at this time. Police tell us they are still looking for that boy and suspect. If you know every, anything, give police a call. Reporting live in downtown Milwaukee, Christina Van Zelst, Fox 6 News. Christina, some of our viewers may say, well, where's the Amber Alert? But we have to reiterate, they don't even know if this was a crime. Yep, that's right. They're still trying to figure it all out. So, of course, we'll keep you updated when we learn more information, hopefully, this week. Yeah, a lot of questions here. All right, Christina, thanks.